Thank you, Ballot 916. Now on your Wednesday, and there are so many reasons to celebrate our dads and the father figures in our lives, but the question becomes, do we do enough to honor them properly? Well, there's a chance to do just that now. Joining us to tell more about the ninth Annual Fatherhood Breakfast is Michael Hurd. Thanks so much for being here this morning. Uh, thanks for having me, John. Yeah, of course. All right, so first things first, I want to talk a little bit about the Alphas. Okay. You guys are a local organization mm -hmm. through and through. You've done so much for the community. For those who might not be familiar, though, just tell us a little bit about the work that you do. Sure. Uh, Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity Incorporated, we've been around for 117 years, uh, doing the same type of work from day one up until now. Uh, we spend a lot of time working with youth, uh, particularly youth of color. Uh, we encourage them to uh, get the best education they can. We have a go to high school, go to college initiative that's been around for a hundred years, mm -hmm. uh, realizing that uh, not many of us are trust fund babies. So education will really be the way to, you know, have the life you want. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And this seems like an event that message is really going to get channeled through, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, when, absolutely. When we're focusing on our fathers, this is something that this is going to be, obviously, I think would touch a lot of people. You said this is very important for you. A little earlier, you and I were talking. Mm -hmm. Why is this event so special? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, not to knock the mothers, but, you know. Oh, of course not. <laughs> yeah, love my mothers. They've got their time, too. Don't worry. <laughs> they do. They do. But especially during this time in uh, the city of Peoria, when we have so much violence going on with boys and young men of color, mm -hmm. uh, I appreciate the great efforts made by Chief Echevarria and by Mayor Ali. But I think the missing piece in all of that is for fathers and those father figures to really step up and fill that void. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about the event. How is it going to help people do that a little more? The event, we're going to leave, we're going to have some very well-fed people when they leave there. Excellent. Always uh, good. Yeah, the event starts <laughs> at, at 9 o'clock. Uh, we are having uh, bicycle giveaways. Uh, we will also be uh, giving awards to some of our outstanding fathers. Ooh, okay. Yeah. So, so how do you qualify for an award then? Uh, we have... Uh, uh, people who have been nominated actually from the work that they do in the community. Oh, that's excellent. Yeah, so that, that's uh, how we usually get our uh, nominees. And uh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to treat them pretty good this year. Yeah, absolutely. This is the ninth running of the event. Is there absolutely. anything you're planning on doing differently or maybe something that you've touched on that you've seen in the evolution of the event over the years? Well, speaking of the evolution of the event, it started with one of our members just having Saturday breakfast with his boys. Oh, nice. And then he thought, hey, what, it would be great to expand this to... So it went on to churches, went to the community, and now here we are at the ninth annual where dads and dad figures get to sit down with boys over a good breakfast. Absolutely. So besides the food, what would you say your favorite part about the event is? Probably my favorite part is watching those kids' faces when, they, when their uh, ticket is a winner for one of the bicycles. Oh, nice. There's going to be some giveaways, too. Yeah, yeah. We hopefully have at least 20 bikes to give away that day. Oh, my gosh. That's excellent. Now, mm -hmm. let's talk about age ranges here. Mm -hmm. What are usually the ages of the kids that come through? Yeah, usually the ages of the kids are anywhere from uh, babies to, you know, 16, 17. Wow. So this really is for truly anybody. Yeah, anybody who is a dad or a dad figure, we're, at, we're inviting them to come on down. Hey, open invitation if I've ever heard one. That's awesome. We're going to throw some information up on your screen there. This is all going to be on the 28th at 9 a.m. Free, open to the public, some great giveaways, an award ceremony. Honestly, this is one of the most important things that you can focus on. It's the family factor and fatherhood. I mean, how do you sell that anymore? Absolutely. So, Michael, thanks so much for coming in today. Uh, really thanks for having me, John. Yeah, so, absolutely. guys, I'll see you Saturday. All righty. <laughs> sounds good. And, of course, you or someone you know wants to come on Talk of the Town, go to 25newsnow.com slash community. Head to that Talk of the Town tab and submit the form. Of course, we want to hear from you as soon as possible. We'd love to have you on the show. And, of course, we've also got some birthdays we've been hearing about as well. We're going to talk about those in just a little bit.